Hello and welcome to the channel. So I'm just having a peek inside my grow tent today and as you can see it is pretty empty. I don't have a lot going on yet. I've only got two things growing in here right now and one of them is my cucumber. This is a diva cucumber that I started from seed. I think it's been over two weeks, three weeks since it sprouted. And as you can see the roots are going crazy already. So this is in the crack key method. So I have nutrient water and just have the hydro balls growing or covering up the uh, container here to keep the light out. I started it in a piece of rock wool and it's starting to get to that four leaf stage. So it's coming along nicely. And over here is my tomato plant that I had taken a cutting from a garden tomato this fall, rooted it and then set it up also in crack key. And when I was having a look here today, I could tell things were not looking very good with this plant. So I was wondering what was going on. And then had a look here into my container and this poor plant is almost drank up all the nutrient water. See if you can see there, there's just a little bit left in the bottom. So that's something to think about when you're doing crack key is making sure you're checking your water levels plant like this that is getting you know growing quite aggressively now will suck up those nutrients that nutrient water within a week or so or that's how it's been for me using this method and this size of container so I mixed up a new batch of nutrient water using the measurements for the aggressive growth level that's on the chart on the container so it's got a little more of the grow um, a little less of the micro and even a little less of the bloom so it's still focusing on growing the plant, even though I do have a little bit of blooming going on. I went with that. I also added five mils of CalMag, so it's getting some extra calcium and magnesium. And then all I do is just top this up. And I usually fill it about, about halfway full. So with the cracky method, you always make sure that you those roots are getting air. They need air to breathe and to grow so you don't want to fully submerge those air roots under the liquid or they will drown and kill the plant. So I filled that about halfway full and I'm sure if I come back tomorrow this will be perked right up and these leaves will be looking healthy again. So just something to remember, once your plants really start growing aggressively, that they will drink that water up very quickly. I always make sure I have a jug of nutrient water mixed up, and then I can just top up my plants as they need it. My cucumber, as you can see, still has lots of water in here, but as this cucumber grows and starts spreading and blooming, it will drink down that water a lot faster. So just a little tip to remember if you're a cracky hydroponic grower to always keep an eye on your water levels in your containers. I personally do not worry about dumping out the whole container and you know filling it up with a whole new batch. I just use the top up system. I've been doing that for the last few years and it has worked pretty good for me. So today I'm going to be planting up some more uh, vegetables to add to my grow tent. I'm doing some more tomatoes, green pepper, and maybe a strawberry if I can find some seeds. And so stay tuned for those videos coming up on the channel. If you haven't already done so, please hit that subscribe button. Leave me a comment and we will see you on the next video.